Hey guys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play our Tunilico Koganel of RCL, where we left off, um, Fennel didn't go back to the restaurant, um, so, um, I got lost looking for her, when all I had to do was stay in town and pretty much just go to every location of the town, like the end, the, the shops, you gotta go to every location on, the, on that you can, and, um, then you find out that, um, she, she's not in town, so, uh, a cutscene plays where um, Alto founds her here. Um, that's where I'm at, and uh, we're gonna see what happens. And why she's here, for that matter. Hey! Uh, Alto! <sighs> what are you doing? We spent the whole day looking for you. Worried about me? Duh! Don't just take off without telling someone. S sir. Huh? What did you say? Nothing. I'm, I'm not a little girl. I can go wherever I want. Why are you being so stubborn? And what were you doing here? This place isn't very safe. I was just watching the stars in the sky. Stars? Uh-huh. I like to gaze at the stars. I know a little about astrology, too. You know, <laughs> cartology. If you know the true name and date of birth of someone you like, you can see whether or not they're in your destiny. Oh, really? I didn't know you had such a girly hobby. about stars for example um, oh I know huh starting with the boreal star over there cartology readings always start there Alto which month were you born I was born in 12th moon why each month has an ancient name 12th moon is called Suzunomia my birth month third moon is called RCL each reading follows a predetermined path of stars. It's based on the number of letters in your true name. The star you end up on is your destiny star. Based on the compatibility of two people's stars, you can see their fate. So it's like a horoscope, pretty much. But a I'm little bit impressed. You do know a lot. A little bit more probably in depth. I've always watched stars since I was a little kid. Whenever I was sad. I would look to the stars above. Huh. <laughs> it sure is beautiful. It feels like they can make me forget all the sadness in the world. Come back with us. We're all worried about you. Are you talking about Soma? Uh, Who would suspect that Clastania's deadliest assassin is actually this clumsy little crybaby? <laughs> yeah, I didn't, for that matter. Please don't tell anyone! Please, keep it a secret! I beg you! What else are you hiding? I don't know what to believe. I don't even know who to trust. Just tell me the truth. I was in Clastania up until a month ago. Uh, Clastania? I don't know when it started. There's been another me inside my mind. It's the same as Saki. But then, why are you attacking us as Soma? And what's that fourth dangerous square thing? What? But you're Soma, right? Not by choice! Who would choose to become such a monster? Yeah. Who would voluntarily kill 
help evil or cause trouble for you and your friends. Sometimes I can't control myself. She forces her way to the surface against my will. Fennel. I'm scared. I always have been. I couldn't tell my secret to anyone. There were times that I wanted to kill myself. Aww. I'm sorry. And now that I understand, you don't have to tell me anything more if you don't want to. Huh? And when you get tired of thinking all by yourself, let me know. I'll be there to watch the stars with you. Oh, no. So don't be scared. I won't tell anyone about it. To be honest, I was just surprised that you're from Clastania. But I won't hold it against you. Anyway, how odd. Part-time mascot girl by day? Deadly assassin by night? Sounds like a popular Telemo show. <laughs> it does, actually. Like, well, it sounds like an anime. I'd watch that. Oh, don't. Yeah. Please, stay by my side a little longer. Huh? I don't want to be alone anymore. I, I don't want to be scared. Please, Aoto, stay with me. Always. Uh, uh, all right. Aww. If you insist, I'll stay with you. But only as your master. <laughs> what? Am I supposed to be your servant or something? Exactly. As of today, you will be my servant until I dismiss you. You have to obey my orders. Wait, why do I? Great, it's decided. Now, swear your loyalty to me. Oh. All right, all right. I'll do it, okay? Hey, that's not how you're supposed to act. Very well, wow. Master. She's very... She really does have that, that weird masochistic... Like, behavior. Is it masochistic? She has that behavior, though. Where she likes to be bossed around a bit. <laughs> well done. As a reward, I'll look into Soma some more. What? Well... You don't know who the heck Soma is, or why she's inside you. I'll help you find out, when I have the time. Uh, uh, what? Uh, uh, um, it, it's nothing. You know that servant thing was just half a joke, right? Half? Look, uh, we better go back now. Hey, Aldo? Yeah? Want to do it? Our cartology reading? What are you talking about? You shouldn't tell your true name to anyone other than your family or life partner. Right. Besides, unlike the view from the tower, there are a lot of hidden stars out here. It wouldn't be accurate. Uh, let's get back. Everyone's worried about you. Okay. Alto, please go on ahead. I'll be there soon. I need to calm down a bit before I face them. Are you gonna be alright by yourself? Uh-huh. Alright. Try not to take too long. Yeah, lady. Life partner. <sighs> Don't you want to live? You are falling for someone. Did you forget? You mustn't fall in love with anyone. You must be alone. Love? I'm not falling in love with anyone! You can't hide your emotions from me. That's why I let Aoto know our true identity. <sighs> so, that was on purpose? Oh, uh, so that she did it. Because she wanted to scare him away from her. Exactly. I know it's shocking, but it will save all of us in the future. Otherwise, 
he would get hurt. No way! I expect Aldo to achieve many things for your sake. But if he turns out to be useless, then I'll have to do the same thing to him that I did to the others. Don't! Damn. You're safe. I was so relieved when Alto told me he found you. Oh, I'm sorry, Saki. Touch me, doctor. Anyway, I'm glad you're back. You look well. So now that everyone's here, why don't we talk about what we're gonna do from there on? Yes, you're going back to Blue Canyon Hamlet, right? I'll go with you. Sure, so. About Saki, can you take care of her at your clinic in the meantime, Doc? Huh? Of course. I'll keep examining her until you come back. Please wait. I want to go with you. Saki, you were attacked in Blue Canyon Hamlet once. What if the Clastanian army comes back? I know, but I still want to help. I couldn't stand only being protected by you. I have to help you too. Saki. And I'm frightened. I don't want to be away from you. But if they see you, we'll be screwed once we step inside the hamlet. Can, can I become another person? What? I see. According to Alto's story, no one in Blue Canyon Hamlet has seen Sarah Patro's face before. You just might be able to deceive the enemy that way. Okay, sure. You can come with us, Saki. But don't push yourself too hard, okay? Alto! Uh, me, me too. No, Finna. Of course, you were already accounted for. Huh? Well, you have to guard me along the way, my loyal servant. <laughs> Why are you treating us so differently? Alright then. I'll also go with you. But you two need a private medical physician. Great. Let's head out together. Off to the hamlet. Hey, Fennel, you said that you would do it. Okay. Wow, that's a little crazy. <laughs> Alright. On our way to Blue Canyon. Oh, wow, yeah. Look, she's Sarah Patra now. her back there. Looking awesome. I actually can dive more, I think, but I'm not gonna bother right now. Don't see a point at the moment. The Great Fang Militia. What are they doing over there? What is that in their hands? That's a Ravatel radar. Huh? They've got to be looking for Saki. 
But they're depending on that device. Maybe they forgot what she looks like. Then what's the point of our decoy? They'll probably capture anyone who set off that machine, right? Don't worry. Use this. If you put this patch over your installer port, you'll stop sending Ravitalik signals. What? Really? Wow, looks like you've got something for everything. Mm, yeah, sort of. Okay, let's go. I wonder why uh, Tots has that. Hey, you, stop! It is forbidden to illegally cross into the territory of Clip. Uh, Alto? The shoe, right? Hey, man, long time no see. You've been gone for a while. Do you know what's been going on since you disappeared? There's a rumor that you ran away with a Ravitel. Hey, what are you doing? We have to check him out. Is that really necessary? As you can see, there's nothing fishy about us. You never know, just in case. I better check everyone. Fine. Why would he check me? Unless he's just checking in between us. No reaction. It seems like there aren't any Ravitels among you. I told you. Okay. Let us through. Come on, everyone. Let's go. Wait. What is it now? Do you guys still suspect us? That woman's not from our hamlet, is she? Um, uh, I'll tell. Is she your wifey? Huh? What the hell are you talking about? Actually, I am. <laughs> huh? What? That we're engaged. We came back to have our wedding in this hometown. Wow, that's great news. And she's so beautiful. Way to go, Alto. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, of course. <laughs> All right. Shall we go, Alto? Gentlemen, would you please be guests at our wedding? Toodaloo. <laughs> really, Sarah Patra? Nah. <laughs> We got away. But, but Miss uh, Sarah Patrick, that was way too smooth to be an ad lib. You, you, Alto's fiance? That's not funny. Oh, that wasn't really a joke. I was able to come out again, so I want to make a lot of sweet memories with Alto. Huh? Uh, uh, well, I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah. Don't take her seriously, you stupid idiot. Ooh, scary. Do you happen to fancy Alto as well? What? No. I like to tattoo me. Yeah, I only like tattoo me. Can you leave me out of this? <laughs> <laughs> that girl has sass. But in order to attract a boy, you may need to gain a little more fruit on your chest. Whoa, that's just mean. I thought he was never coming back to town. Yeah, it's quite a surprise. With a bride, Steve will be happy to hear the news. More importantly, let's report this to them. Wait, are you seriously gonna sell him out? I can't stab him in the back. Of course we are. Do you want all of us to be cleansed? We have families, he brought this all upon himself. Sorry, Alto. No, they're not, Oh man. This is gonna suck. No, he had sold out. It's not gonna be pretty. Jeez. I have no idea how to get to the um, where we're where we're going. Let me deal with this. Let me handle this. I forget how many personalities are in these girls. I know there's more than one for sure. I mean, we've seen the knight and uh, Sarah Pacha from um, Saki. So they definitely have a bunch of forms in themselves. If I keep diving, I'll probably run into the rest. Let me deal with this! 
more battles. Stay alert, they're battles. coming to us. Take them down! Take them down! Yeah! I'll be Please be the right way. Let me deal with this! Stay alert! They're coming to us! <laughs> yeah! I'll give you a perfect... It's so weird when you skip it that it just kind of like cuts all the music off like that. Like a little too abruptly. I don't know. Chalk it up to a lot of weird. I guess in this game. Up the ladder. Let me deal with this! Let me handle this. Take the Yeah! Yeah! Battles, so that's a good thing. Straight run to uh, the hammer. Should probably save it just in case. I hope there's no game breaking bugs that might appear at some point. I'm really afraid of that. Alright, I'll go to Steep's place for now. What are you guys gonna do? I'll go to the temple, where I used to stay. Then why don't we spread out into two groups? Sarapatra, Fennel, and I will... I want to be alone without help. Um, uh, well... <laughs> then I'll go with Tatsumi. We'll be alone together. It'll be like a date, right? Huh? I thought you were gonna guard me. I don't need any com company. But I want to go with you. Alto, you should go have fun with Sarah Patra. Why are you pouting? I I'm not pouting. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> okay, I'll go with Alto too. I'm worried about Saki. Though I'm sorry about being a third wheel. Oh, how sad. It... it Dude, Doc. Okay, I'll tell him. Steeps! He's not here. Did he go out? I better look around town. It's been a while since I left. Anything in my room I could take? That'd be cool. I doubt it. All right. Oh, hello. Hey, is that true that Alto's back? Yeah, and even more so, he brought back a bride. A bride? That's big trouble. Yo, you guys, long time no see. Oh, speaking of him. Hey everyone, the happiest man in the world has come back. Uh, eh? <laughs> Congratulations, man. I remember when you were li a little kid, but now you you're getting married? Time does fly. 
Uh, well, this is just... That's the beautiful bride? B bride no... Uh, oh, did you say beautiful bride? I feel flattered. Yes. She's indeed an extraordinary beautiful woman. I don't think Alto deserves such a beauty. <laughs> That's not true. I love him from the bottom of my heart. That is Sarah Patra. Don't joke around. Don't be shy, happy man. Damn, what a sweet wife. I feel like I lost him as a man. <laughs> wife? Oh, no. <laughs> uh, Sarah Patra. You guys just sit in the corner and play rock, paper, scissors. I think you lost to everyone. Is this a shop? No. Nope. This guy is, though. Shoppy man. Anything I can get here? I took two of those. So I can have it. Two of those. And three of those. Thank you. Can I talk to them? Do they know where Steeps might be? I didn't mean to go in there, but okay. Enjoy rock, paper, scissors, guys. Okay, uh... Paper, scissors. God's fail. Oh no, this is where my home is. Is he back? He is! Oto! Hey, Steve, I'm back. Sorry I made you worry. You... Steeps? Oh, uh, well, welcome back, son. Y you had me worried. Um, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, so is this... Is she the smashing bride you brought back with you? Not this again. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Angel. What's your name? My name is Sarah Patras, sir. What a mean name! It's not very common, but it's the same name as the goddess of love from ancient mythology. Aoto told me a lot about you, sir. Please allow me to call you my father-in-law. What a nice beauty! Are you sure you deserve this fine young woman, Auto? I heard the same thing a million times before I got here. Hmm. I still can't believe it. You're getting married! Anyway, we have to celebrate! I'm proud of you, Auto. Steeps? What's wrong with you? Normally, you'd be like... What the hell were you doing not working? And then punch me! Whoa, wh what are you talking about? Nothing's wrong! R really? But I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to make you worry. That's all in the past. Today is a day of celebration! Here, I just made this. Eat, drink, sing! He certainly is a nice man, Aoto. Yeah, he is. Ah, oh, Steeps is awesome. <laughs> uh, I'm tired. I know the ends justify the means, but this is getting out of hand. Small towns and their gossip. What'll I do now? At this rate, I'm gonna have to marry Sarah Patra. Oh no. It'll just be a mock wedding. We're not really getting married. <laughs> what am I doing here? Uh, it could I be worse. Sleep. Uh, who's there? Ah, uh, Tom? 
Oh god. I melt when she does that, I swear. Sarapatra! I'm having trouble with the nightly chill. It's particularly harsh on my unweathered skin. Will you keep me warm? What? Do you know what you're asking? Oh? Now my body's too hot. It's almost burning. <laughs> and it's all because of you. You better take responsibility, Aoto. Oh, you're no longer cold. Well, good for you. <laughs> but you better go back to your room before you catch a cold, all right? <laughs> good night. Oh, what a wuss. Although, it's not like I mind your innocence. Listen, I'm only doing this because I've been thinking about many ways to protect Saki. This is the best I can do. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it's fine. You're so nice. Almost too nice. I understand why Saki's attracted to you. Uh huh? That was a joke. Well, half of one. It is true that there is a certain affectionate feeling for you within me. However, they completely belong to Saki. I just share a body with her. But she's so shy, so I thought I'd help her out. Right. It seems like I've been rejected. You know, it's not that I don't like you. I mean... I wouldn't mind if it was Saki, but this is just too confusing. Well, color me jealous. But that's all right. You're like my cute young brother. So I'm getting rejected Besides, from being not from getting her from rejecting her, and she's getting she rejected. Huh? Each persona has different taste in men. Of course. Each one of us grew up in a different environment, and we all have different lives. Uh, is that right? How did that happen? Yes, it is. <laughs> Although for us, it's a serious no-no to fall in love with someone. It's taboo? Exactly. But now that I'm out in the world, it's boring not to be able to love someone. Don't you agree? Therefore, although it's forbidden, I'll support your lovely future together. Personally, I think it's good for her. So you're like Saki's big sister, huh? <laughs> sort of. We Persona are always watching her from inside her mind. She's reserved and doesn't assert herself as much as she should. So we're all a little frustrated, but now she's gonna be your bride. I'm more than happy to help her. Hey, Alto. Oh. I feel like oh. kissing you. So forward. That's that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Whoa, hey, stop. <laughs> okay. Why don't we hold off on this until the ceremony? Good night, Alto. See you tomorrow. No, wait. Oh. Do you want to sleep in the same bed with me? No. Are you really gonna go through with the wedding? I know it's for Saki's sake, but we're not even in love. It's just a formality. We can't get away with not doing it after inviting everybody to come. Yeah, but I can't have a wedding with her other persona while she's... like asleep. I feel bad for her. You sound like a boyfriend who doesn't want to make her jealous. <laughs> it's not like that. I just... Why don't we tell them the truth? If we come clean with everything, they might let Saki escape. Aoto, you trust people too easily. Huh? This isn't just between you and your boss. Besides, if protecting Saki truly is your top priority, you shouldn't have a problem with deceiving people sometimes. Even if it means you have to deceive Saki herself. We'll only be protecting her. Don't worry. As I said before, I'm still Saki, and Saki is still me. Her fate is my fate. Do you not like me that much? No, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm sorry. I couldn't help picking on you. 
Let's get some rest already. Good night, Owl Talk. Uh. Owl Talk? Thank you for caring about Saki so much. I guess she's just messing with me. All right, whatever. I'm tired, so I'm going to sleep. Drag you along my whole hey, I'm back tour. <laughs> no worries, I had never been to a temple before. That was fun. All right, my room's next door, so if you need me, please knock first. Hey, we finally have the chance to talk alone. Look, I don't want to get involved in your whole drama thing. If you really need to do that, do it with Auto. Why did you bring him up? I mean, please, sit with me, just for a minute. Uh, what did you need to talk about? Um, I always wanted to ask you something. What is it? Tatsumi, you have the heart of Gaia, don't you? The heart of Gaia. <laughs> Who are you? You do, don't you? Please, give it to me! Are you crazy? I can't just give it to a girl who likes me. It's something precious that was entrusted to me. Who entrusted it to you? What are you supposed to do with it? Well, first of all, how do you even know about the heart of Gaia? And second, why do you want it? L that's the heart of Gaia. <laughs> now, if you guys remember, at least in the story, guys, we only know one person who was entrusted the heart of Gaia, and we know who by whom, so far. If you watched my Artsinelico uh, 2 playthrough, you, you know, so, something's going on here why Tatsumi would have it. Do you happen to know Harvestasha? Yeah, uh, yes, I know her. Do you also know where she is? I was told to deliver it to Harvestasha. Uh, I can't tell you where she is. I've been sworn to secrecy. Damn. Then what should I do? Uh, I can deliver it to her for you. You? In fact, Harvestasha herself told me to do so. She told me to bring her the heart of Gaia. No, I can't. I have to deliver it myself. That is my true purpose here. So she wants the heart of Gaia, but she can't let anyone know where she is? What's up with that? Well, you see... Alright, let's just say for a second that your story is true. I can believe that because you're a Ravitale. But please don't tell me there's a connection between Harvestasha and Clastania. No, that's not true. Sure, she's in the tower, but she's not a Clastanian. Oh, so she's in the tower? <laughs> Shoot! Well, anyway, I can't give you the heart of Gaia. There are still too many mysteries about you. But then Harvestasha will... All right, then how about this? Take me to see Harvestasha. We'll go together. What? Even if she told you not to tell anyone where she is, if we go together, she can still meet both of us. Please? Uh. I have to meet Harvestasha for myself. There's a very important question I need to ask her. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you, Fennel. Then let's go, right now. What? Now? We were both asked to do it. And we better do it quick. I want to set out tomorrow morning. But uh, what about Aldo? We can tell him we suddenly got some stuff we need to do together. Do you owe him or something? No. <laughs> 
not really. But... You're right. He's got Saki. And I'm just a servant to him after all. All right, let's tell him first thing in the morning, and then we can head off for Ciela Gate. Sure. How to Good morning, darling. Uh, Sarah Petra. It's almost time for our wedding. You better start getting ready. I'm gonna put my dress on. See you at the temple. W wait, sir. Hey, what do you mean by wedding? Are you really gonna go through with this? Yo, Aoto! On such an important day like this, how can you oversleep for your wedding ceremony? You bastard! <laughs> Steeps! Even the mayor is here? Wake up and get prepared. You guys look kind of like twins. Once you're ready, come to the center of the hamlet. Uh, hey, wait, I'm just... It seems like it's time to make up your mind, Aoto. Doc, don't just watch from over there. Help me out. Why, what's wrong with this? I love to see people happy. Doc! Stop whining. What? Got the wedding day blues? We've got no time for that now! Time? What are you talking about? Your honey is waiting for you, my son. How can you keep her waiting? My Get ready honey. And come to the hamlet outskirts. Don't blow your own ceremony, Alto. It's a little weird, but there you go. <laughs> Wedding day. Wow. They really did it up. Congratulations, Audi! May the goddess of love be with you, Sarah Patra! Thank you, everyone. Alto, we'll live happily together forever and ever. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be kidding. Don't dilly dally around. We're going to go impromptu on this. Let's get it done fast. Right. Now, you may kiss the bride. Damn, that was quick. What? Kiss? I was wondering why no one was at Steve's house. Wow, this is a big event. No! Oh. Oh no. Oh, she turned back. What are you two uh, doing? Uh, Fiddle! Uh, what are you doing? Uh, what's uh -oh. this soft <laughs> thing I'm grabbing? Uh, uh, oh, you, you like it rough? Oh, my God. S Saki! I'm so, so sorry! It's, it's it was just a mistake! What the hell is going on? Sarah Patra turned into someone else! Oh shit! Oh shit! This isn't good! Yeah, this is terrible. Hey, everyone! Listen up! I can explain everything! Auto! Who is this girl? 
You look very oh happy, God. Naoto. The, the manly voice. Butch! <laughs> Who's a butch? <laughs> Aoto, playtime's over! Wait! This isn't what I was expecting. Steeps? I, I thought you would wait until the ceremony was over. Huh? You humans took too long. I don't have that much patience. Steeps? What the hell's going on? <laughs> Sorry, Aoto. What's that supposed to mean? Please don't hate us. We had to do it for the sake of the future of Great Fang. What? I appreciate your cooperation, Mayor. The report said he was with his allies, but I didn't expect Saki to be with him. As promised, we won't cleanse Blue Canyon Hamlet. Clustania, you cowards! You threatened them into obeying you? I'll never forgive you for this! Cut it out, Aoto! Please, don't bring any more trouble to our village! Man! Alto, it's over. They sold us out to Clustania. Alto, Alto. Son of a bitch! Here I am, you scum! I'll deal with you all myself! I don't need anyone's help! <laughs> it's no use. This is exactly how we expected this to go. What? They put something in her. Drowsy. Yeah. They drugged her. Saki! Hey! What did you do to her? I put a tranquilizer in the sacred wine you had during the ceremony. It should be about to kick oh, in. Oh, they drugged us. Good night, sucker. Damn it! My body won't move. Auto! Auto! Huh? <laughs> Stupid pipsqueak! <laughs> Wow, that laugh. Shit. You son of a bitch. Alto. I won't fall asleep. I won't let Saki go. I said it's no use. You guys, take Saki. I won't let any of you lay a finger on her. I promised. He's gone. Damn. We're caught. Where am I? Oh, hello. <sighs> My lucky Soma didn't show up. Um. All right. I'm in this here, guys. On the next part, we figure out who this mysterious nurse is. Um, leave a like, subscribe. Sorry, this was a long one. I wanted to get a nice big episode out. And here you go. Uh, yeah. Bye!